What's up guys? Another day, another video. We are in Austin, Texas to check out some filming locations for the movie Office Space. Office Space is one of my favorite movies. I'm uh, very excited to be here. So right behind me is the restaurant where Jennifer Aniston worked. Now obviously it's a Chase Bank now, not even a restaurant. The building's completely different, but this is where she worked. There was a famous scene where they're out here standing in the parking lot and the former employee of the restaurant well the employee of the restaurant comes out and makes fun of jennifer anderson for flipping off the boss pretty funny scene um just a great moment obviously the building looks nothing like it did before so it's kind of hard to grasp that it even was filmed here but um, we're going to check out a few other locations let's do it the colors are very similar to the same way they were in the movie. Like I remember it being brown. Exterior shots at least. Not like that. Yeah. Guys at another office space location. There wasn't very many of these to do. But this one is in a tech. This is where they, well, the, ex the film exteriors of where the business used to be, but there it is right there. I'm gonna show you on the phone and then you can see kind of what it used to look like. They must have the in tech thing built right next to it or something, Weird. Weird. only for the movie. Completely. Like the entrance? Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely. And I'm sure it was only used for exteriors. I don't think the interiors were filmed in there. Uh, but just for the opening shot, I guess, walking in. Pretty sure this is the angle here. Maybe this little tree wasn't here. This one? The sign, the Inatex sign would have been there. And then the little globe thing over there. Pretty wild that they built all that just for the exterior of a shot. Like I said, I'm not sure, even sure if they filmed anything inside. But, uh, definitely cool. Texas thing. <laughs> Driver of innovation. <laughs> yeah. He, his, um, oh wow! Oh my God! <laughs> I missed it. I'm glad you got that on video. <laughs> I was zoomed in. I, I hope I got it exactly, but it was pretty cool. No, he just went from zero to a hundred real quick. <laughs> He's so cute. Hello. Hey, buddy. Are you sleeping? No, he's watching something. He's watching the kids, maybe. I like monkeys, but then again, I don't trust them, you know? Like, this guy's intently watching him. He's moving his hand around doesn't even want to pay look at me at all. Oh my god. Is it? It could be. Hey buddy. Oh my god. It's terrifying. I love you. Looks like he's shedding a little bit. Hello. Hello. Hello, hello. He's coming over. Hello you. Yeah, he's shedding his He's coming right over. Hello. Hi, handsome. Hi. I wish I had something for you. I don't. Are you so sweet? He's like, you don't have anything? 
Yeah. Yep. See you. Oh, there he is. He's up top. He's up top. Yep. Oh, okay. I see you. See him? Cute. That's how coyotes are supposed to be, like size wise. Really? Yeah. So, like, um, if you see anything bigger than that, then it's probably a combination of a coyote and something else. Oh, I was thinking it looked big for a coyote. <laughs> yeah. Well, is it just a regular coyote or eastern coyote? Yeah. And the, the puffy tail thing is a dead giveaway, too. See mm -hmm. that little tail? Yeah, they're generally afraid of humans. That's definitely a wolf. Yep. They have a little thing here about wolf hybrids. Where me and Jason saw, we definitely convinced we saw some wolf hybrids in Tennessee. Because they were definitely bigger than that coyote I see. And they looked a lot more like this. So just kind of cool and interesting. And he's right over there. White wolf. Hey little guy. He's so cute. Look at him. He looks a lot like the other one, just a little, a little different. Oh, there's one here. There's one here. Look. Hello. Hello, you. Capuchin monkey. These are the sneaky ones. They're smart. Uh huh. Yeah. Those, those are like the helper monkeys that like people like. Oh, like, like yeah, like steal. Uh... Yeah, remember that episode of Malcolm in the Middle where like the fat coworker is in the car. He's in a full body case mm -hmm. and he gets the capuchin monkey to help, but the monkey doesn't like him. Hey, little guy. <laughs> How are you? Oh. Hello, what happened to the hair on your head? Mm -hmm. <laughs> really scratching your armpit with your foot. That's pretty cool. <laughs> yeah. Hey, buddy. <laughs> He's so cute. So big. They're so big. This one's using his leg as like a pillow. I wonder how old they are. You know? I wonder how old they are. Mm -hmm. Hey, little guy. Are you napping? Mm -hmm. That one over there is. Yeah. <laughs> No, they're incredible, man. Look at this one. He's looking up. Hey, buddy. He's got some lettuce on his Yeah. <laughs> Residue. He woke up from his nap. Hey, handsome. What's up, buddy? You can go back to sleep. Slowly puts his head down. Hey, buddy. So cool. Hey, how are you? Look at that face. I love their eyes. Such old eyes. Look at their little, uh, his little eyes. He's a big boy. Yeah, he's napping. <laughs> he's out like a light. Mm -hmm. Alright, we'll come back. Hey, little guy. What are Chuck. you doing? Chuck. That's his name. He looks right at me. 
What? What was that, buddy? You gonna sing for us? Hmm? It's just a stick. Here is the emu. The Australians lost a war to this bird. And when they tried to shoot at it, they couldn't kill him, or Bailey could kill him because of their fur or whatever. So it was so thick. Now that was like old school guns, but still. You should check it out, it's an interesting story. You got one? What a sweetie. So big. Pretty big though, that's terrifying. But I haven't seen that in a while. And if I remember correctly, I could be wrong. I think cougars are the ones that'll attack you from behind. Or is that mountain lions? No, I'm not sure. One of the two. Mm -hmm. Yeah, a little different, I guess. Mountain lions, I think, are, are smaller. Is there another one? Hey, buddy. Kiko. Kiko de Gaia? <laughs> I know. See him like turn away. Uh, yeah, that's why he's up there, I think. What are you? You little sweeties? That guy's so little. He's a little guy. Mm -hmm. He's like a little Tom. Oh, hello. Oh, he's hiding something. Yeah. You see him? Yep, yep. Oh my god, is he gonna eat that? I think so. It looks like a yep. potato. Mm -hmm. Oh, you hear cute. him chirping? It's so cute. Hey, little guy. You hear him? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what that is, but he's cute. Hi. Are you a little guy? He's talking to me. <laughs> oh my god, do you get are you getting his mouth right now? <laughs> I'm trying, it's hard. Here, stand around, stand around. It's hard to uh, like focus on the camera. Because I have to have it zoomed in a little bit. <gasps> You're so cute. You are so cute. Just a little guy. Hey little guy. Hard to see. Right, they'll respond to this. <laughs> no, no. Something is cooling. Hey, yeah, I don't know if that's the water or what. I couldn't figure that out. <laughs> 
All right, guys, we got some zebras back there. He definitely looks smaller. Definitely smaller. Every time I see a zebra, and uh, now that I uh, pan over here, and where's the ostrich? There's the ostrich. It makes me think of uh, Swiss Family Robinson. Oh yeah, <laughs> that's great. Yeah, they try to you know ride the zebra as a mm -hmm. horse and, and the, the ostrich and the ostrich for that matter. They have the race. Yeah. On the beach. Yep. <gasps> Did you hear me just? Like whinnied? Not quite whinnied, but <laughs> did a horse up, uh, you know, like, that's exactly it, yeah. Cute. That's cool. Well, I wouldn't pet him. Why not? I think it says don't. Yeah. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Yeah, that deer back there is kind so of weird. weird. Yeah, <laughs> like, is it supposed to be there? I don't know. Something tells me no. Yeah, llamas are spitty. They spit a lot. They just think you have food. Hello. Let's see. Oh, they're like me now. Mm-hmm. <laughs> see, they're just like not interested. <laughs> Unless you have food, then they're interested. Oh, this one's moving. Nice. I didn't see that one. <laughs> it was on the move. <laughs> By on the move, I mean <laughs> just a little bit. Just to get into a nice relaxing position. No, these are lazy gators. Yeah. Well, it's cold too, so they yeah. Friend. Oh, this is the snake from Lion King. Oh, wow. You can tell by the shape of his head. <laughs> yeah, it's like a... Hello, you chocolate chip, you bearded dragon, you little sweet. Oh, it's a boa? Yeah, it's a boa. An emerald tree boa. You can kind of tell just by... From northern South America. That's crazy. Alright. Yeah. He's cool looking. Mm -hmm. Yellow mud turkey. Very soon. Is he his milk? There's a snake down here. Just his tail sticking out. Oh no. Can you see his head or no? No, not at all. I don't know where his head is. Oh, I think it's up here. Up top. Cool. I just don't want to fall. Yeah, that's wild. Oh my god, look at this here. It's huge. And then there's this guy. Oh my god, that guy cracks me up. And then this is venomous over here, they said. Blueberry is his name. He's so cute. Wow, look at this one. There's his head right there. Venomous reptile, Diablo. Hey, buddy. He's a Vulcanstricta, he's starting to move. This one's venomous, I think. He's, uh, this one's like... Ball python. He looks really cool, this guy. Oh, wow. You barely see him in there. There's desert heaven now. Wow. You see him? There he is. Hey, handsome.
I love the waterfall. Montezuma Cypress. Look how big that is. Oh, uh, the palm tree died. It's a bummer. Oh, Ginkgo Bioba. You know, the, the mind uh, thingy. Yeah, yeah, yep. Yeah. The mind supplement. Got some dino traps. Well, he's close by. My God. Hmm. What if they had something there? Yeah, right for who? <laughs> There's an old fence up there. Old iron fence. People. Oh no, this hasn't been used in a while. That's cool though. See inside. There we go. Mm -hmm. Bench. Mm -hmm. Bench. Table. Table. Yeah, these look like original. I don't know if they are. No, donated. They could just be replicas of what cabins would have looked like in that time period more likely than anything. Oh, it is. It is old. Built around 1838. It's a Swedish guy. Hello. I'm Swedish too. in there and we got handcuffs and cool shit to play with. So take off your clothes and get in the car. Come on. 
That's really cool. Cool, so it looks totally different now. I can't even get the right shot because it would be from that front parking lot, technically.